Hi everybody, it's 314 Reactor here, and I'm playing Unreal Tournament 2004 today. So we're going to play a couple of maps, uh, 4K, running 144 hertz. So it's pretty much running as best as it can be. Also going to chuck in a spooky map, which will be some sort of haunted mansion map that I found. And also I'm going to try the mod Hollow Moon, which uh, had its last update 10 years ago. So unfortunately it's never gotten complete, but we're going to see how scary it is so first off let's do i know what we're gonna do first off we're gonna do ctf on lava giant 2 because i love this map it wasn't in the original 2003 or 2004 i don't think but you can download it it was on unreal championship i think for the xbox but you have to download it from somewhere like mod db for UT2004. But I've always loved Lava Giant because it's just awesome. It's an awesome map. This game still does look really good. Blue flag taken. Red flag taken. Blue flag, blue flag returned. Red flag, red flag returned. Blue flag taken. Oh. Alright. I've got a plan. Blue flag returned. Oh, I'm dead. No, I'm not. Yep, I'm dead. Okay, so... Oh, there we go. <laughs> so you're supposed to just jump down there, or is there another way down there? Oh, of course, I can use the... Uh... There we go. Right. I'll get the Ion Painter. Which is... Whoop. It's one of the coolest weapons in any game ever. And here's why. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> it's basically like the Ion Cannon from uh, Command and & Conquer. And that's awesome. So I really stuffed this full of bots. So... This could be a bit chaotic. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. My god, that was a lot of bullets. Oh! Ha! Huh, turned into a skeleton. Yeah, the weapon models still look really nice. Blue flag taken. Boom, boom. Whoop! Ooh, nasty. So I like the ASMD shot rifle a lot better in this one than I did in 2003. That one was absolutely horrible. This still isn't my favourite one, but... Red flag taken. It's a lot more aesthetically pleasing. Screw it. Blue flag, blue flag returns. Oh. Blue flag. Alrighty, so let's go on to another map. Oh, Morpheus 3. That's what I'm talking about. Let's do a bit of that. Oh, oh, man. Man, 
man, this is... There's a chance I've put too many bots in this map. This is cool, though. So, I said we're going to mix it up a bit, so let's move on to the mod Hollow Moon, which uh, is a total conversion, and from what I remember playing it 10 years ago, it was extremely scary. So, yeah, I'm not looking forward to it, so let's do it. Fucking hell. Oh god. This is... Nothing's happening, but it's scary as shit. Fuck. I thought that was like two people over there then. You got no weapons either, that's the thing. I keep, I keep, I keep thinking I see things on the horizon. Music. The music's gonna kick in again, isn't it? Let's turn it down a bit. Oh, uh, don't. It's a shame they never um, completed this. This is just the demo. The demo version 3 they did. Um, and there's been no development on it since, which is a shame, really. Because it looks like it has potential. if this is not any jump scares, but I assume... Fuck! Yep, except that jump scare. The music jump scares. I don't know how this is going to come out in a video. Because I imagine watching it is quite slow. And laborious, but playing it is... Really, really intense. I keep thinking I see things on the horizon as well. Like I'm being watched. Like those things from Mario 64. Oh, please, please, please don't let something run by that door. If something runs by that door... Ah! Okay, yep. Okay. Alright. Okay. Oh god. S sounds like I'm exaggerating my reactions, but they're not. They're real. If this was in VR, I don't think I could play it. Maybe I am just a wimp. Maybe I am just a wimp. Hangar 17. That doesn't sound good, does it? Ah, uh, I saw something moving. No, I didn't. Oh, Jesus. Oops. No, grab hold the ladder. Grab hold the ladder. Okay. Don't worry about it. So I think I'm starting to get used to this game now. I'm starting to feel a bit more settled and a little less freaked out. Is that blood? Oh, God. Oh, quarantine zone. Oh god, what am I going to find down here? 
This is just rather claustrophobic, scary, weird. Is that how it's going to happen? Whoa! Oh, fucking God. Oh, great. As if it couldn't get any more claustrophobic and horrible. I don't like the idea that all these people like barricade themselves in. That's never a good sign, is it? If they did barricade themselves in, where are they all now? Oh. Blow up the coffee machine. So there's the control room. Not sure what it's controlling or doing. So I mean, that's pretty freaky. It's a freaky game. A freaky mod, a total conversion. But it's a shame they never fully released it because um, it just seems a bit unpolished or I'm just too scared to play it properly. And I'm stuck in this uh, area now. I'm sure there's a way out, but I'm not sure how well this is gonna come out in a video. So I'm gonna stop there and then we're gonna load up a couple of spooky Halloween maps for Unreal Tournament 2004. That's what we're gonna do. All right, so here we are back in good old, not terrifying Unreal Tournament 2004. Haunted Mansion SE. Ha! <laughs> right. So you may notice the weapons look a bit better than usual because I'm using a field of view mod, which I'll link in the description, which you can use to increase the field of view, set the aspect ratio, and make the guns look a bit better without being about an inch from your face. Oh, wow. Oh yeah. Whoa. Not sure what that does. <laughs> Pumpkin adrenaline. I like it. So I think there's a graveyard outside you can get to. So look. Yep, here we go. I like the red little vials. That's cool. Someone's in the crypt. Okay, no, they're not. Oh, yeah. So let's hit up a bit of Inferno. Ooh, that looks nice. This game is so smooth that, uh, High frame rates, high refresh rate. Like 144 just feels really nice. And the game's. The game's graphics still look pretty appealing. The art style's pretty. pretty good. I mean, you can't really, uh. can't really fault the art style. It holds up, in my opinion. Oh, look at that. That's cool. Very Doom 3. Thank you. Whoops. 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 I can't remember if this is one included with the game or not, or whether it was a uh, one I downloaded. Either way, it's cool. I just wish this assault rifle wasn't so weak.
we go. Like, I'm pretty sure the Enforcer in the original game is more powerful than that, that, uh, assault rifle. like the feel of this flat cannon. Oh, God. I suppose that's why it's relatively weak, because you can dual wield it. That makes sense. Well, personally, I'd just rather not have the dual wielding and just have it be a bit more powerful. You have won the match. <laughs> this, this guy's victory stance is brilliant. Alrighty, so that was a couple of maps from Unreal Tournament 2004. A scary but relatively uneventful total conversion. A haunted mansion map. It's just not as good as the one I remember in UT99 that I'll be getting to hopefully next week. So... Thank you for watching. If you like this, please give a like and subscribe. And keep an eye out for my Unreal Tournament 99 20 year retrospective. That'll be coming up, I think, around the end of November. Yep, when it hits the 20th anniversary. So, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.